person attempted to remove this large pipe that was stuck in concrete. And in doing so, they mixed some products together that created pressure, heat, and created this explosion. The device lifted up off the ground approximately 25 feet, uh, went, punched a hole inside of the, uh, the building that's the south of us, the two-story, and then ricocheted and landed inside of this building. The services were being held in the front of the building. The explosion was in the back. Um, so it wasn't an explosion like you'd imagine, um, you know, that, that magnitude. Um, so everybody was just wondering. Uh, there wasn't a, a panic. There was a child that was sleeping almost directly under where the device landed on the, uh, the roof. Fortunately, it didn't break through the rafters. It held. Um, they evacuated, and they're the ones that actually uh, made the initial 911 call to us. When the uh, police department and the fire department came, we realized it was something more serious, and uh, we evacuated the building, continued the services on the street. This appears at this time to have been some kind of an industrial situation. Um, no explosives were found, but clearly uh, forensic ex examination will be done uh, to determine what precisely happened. Yeah. Move this way, though,